Hey guys, it's your girl Aisha Shasha and today I'm going to be showing you how I painted my 3D portrait. Now this 3D printed sculpture is actually done for me by the lovely Tan Chu who's also the same person who made my amazing new logo that I absolutely love. I'm going to put a link in the description box below to her Instagram, she's fabulous. And I'm going to be painting it using the Angelus brand of paint. Now these are the same paints that I use whenever I am painting my shoes and usually you would use a uh, leather preparer or deglazer um, and I did that initially on this and then I realized oh it's kind of taking off the color so let's not do that. <laughs> I'm also using my cute little machine fan here to help me dry the layers of paint in between coats. Now you might be saying, but hold on a second, Aisha, why didn't you just spray paint it white? That would be so much easier. It would take so much less time. Um, because I didn't think of it. That's the reason why. <laughs> so here I am putting on layer upon layer upon layer of uh, white paint on this thing. And I was kind of like trying to skirt around the actual sculpture. And then I thought, you know what? Forget that. Let me just paint the whole thing white because like, it, it all needs to have a whitewash anyway. So. As you can see, I've only done like one, possibly two coats on like my actual face and body. And on the back, I've done like probably about five coats of white paint. Um, and then, yeah, I just went ahead and just filled it all in. This was actually a really therapeutic process. I thoroughly enjoyed doing it. Now, this is the really fun part because you really start to see the whole thing like come to life. Once I started to add in the rainbow hair, I was like, oh my gosh, it's actually starting to look like me. <laughs> but for this green, I had to make it lighter because like it was just a bit too dark for me. So um, yeah, I just added in a bit of white just to lighten it a bit. Same here with the blue and with the purple, um, I actually made it darker in some places too. Um, but yeah, I absolutely enjoyed doing this, even though, as you can probably tell, I'm not really the best painter. But I still had fun. As you can see, I went through multiple tools when it came to painting this thing. I've used brushes of all different sizes and I actually used a really, really thin dotting tool to do the little grooves in between my strands of hair. Um, I find it really difficult to sort of like paint straight lines. <laughs> So um, yeah, the dotting tool actually did help me with that. And yes, the Angelus paints, they do come with a brush inside of the cap as well, which is really, really handy. Now don't laugh at me. I actually tried to give myself a little bit of highlight and contour when I was doing this. <laughs> like seriously, like who do I think I am? Like why am I trying to highlight and contour my face? <laughs> Oh my gosh, I am way too extra. Um, but yeah, this part actually did give me a little bit of trouble. The eye, I just couldn't quite get it to look right. Um, and you know, I'm still not a thousand percent on it, but it, it was just the best that I could do. I changed it multiple times throughout this process. she is all painted now just time for me to add the glitter because come on there was no way that i was going to have this and not have glitter on it okay <laughs> so um i'm now using the uh the gloss the angelus gloss putting on a thin layer of that and then putting some glitter on top and just repeating that about two or three times and this actually holds the glitter in really really well um i did the same thing when i made my little twin stars trainers i just added glitter on top of the gloss and it works really really well now time for the big reveal and in true Aisha Shasha fashion I wear everything <laughs> now I have thought about putting this into a bow and I probably could do that I just need to add a um a hair clip on the back of it and then I can slide it into a bow but I also love wearing it as a necklace as well thank you so so much Tan Chu for this amazing sculpture I hope that I have done it justice and I hope that you enjoyed this video Take care, my darlings, and I'll see you all soon.
Bye.